Have you ever heard of Coys? Block 34? Yeah. They used to have a pretty good size. Uh, a way. pond. They had about six or seven koi in there. After the war, they ate those fishes. Who did? The people, I mean, the man that was raising them. And you know these koi for prize koi? They were worth thousands of dollars. <laughs> Where did they get prize koi? Huh? This, this man brought them all in. He asked permission, so they brought him in, and he raised them until the war was over. And then he ate them. <laughs> I, I ain't going to say he ate them or what have you, but like I said, they disappeared. And now, when you were fishing, were you fishing for the really expensive koi? Koi that were in the farm. Oh, if that, if the, the kois that was, it wasn't in the garden type of place. It was made privately by him that brought in the kois. And if he, he caught you fishing for the kois, <laughs> I don't think you'd be living very long. <laughs> because you know how much those kois cost at that time? When he ate them, we were saying, he ain't valuable fish, okay? But for that five years that he kept them, those koi's were $1,000 a piece. Amazing. Now, where was his private pond that he kept? <laughs> Here. <laughs> Let me bend over. Sure. Okay. Let's say this is the place we ate. This is the hospital, and this is where he had his pond. So nobody got there. It was all fenced in. Nobody could get into it, and nobody could get out if they got into it. So he kept it very private. So you would, couldn't even, if you had gone over that fence, you would have gotten into oh, trouble. Oh, boy, my dad would have beat my ass. And everyone knew that these koi were in there. Oh yeah, everybody knew, because it's not it's not like he had it covered and what have you. He had it done. Uh, it was a pond where the fish it were moving around. So, oh yeah, that I remember. Okay, when even when you're young, you remember something like the fishes and stuff. 